Good morning, happy Monday. It's early, it's like eight o'clock, which is way earlier than I typically get up, but it's a really exciting day here because one, it's eclipse day. Two, it's the start of harvest. And thanks to the vintners for this kick-ass t-shirt. Like I said, it's our championship season. So it's the, it's the time that we all work all year for and it starts now. So everyone's starting to harvest Sauvignon Blanc today. Last week I started with the, uh, the sparkling stuff, but today is really like the start of it all. It feels like we're in the thick of it. And then also I'm heading up to Rudd Farms up on Mount Veter, which grows all of our produce for press. And then this place here, Oakville Grocery, which is where I got coffee. I love Oakville Grocery. They're open early for coffee, for pastries. They make sandwiches. They have pre-prepared stuff. They have awesome things if you're looking for uh, some souvenirs, some gifts for people. Uh, it's just a really cool place. And then this is Durant and Booth. This is the tasting room right next door. So you can grab your lunch. You can come next door, do wine tasting, and then sit out here in this beautiful patio right in the heart of Oakville. So I highly recommend doing that. They serve tailor-made coffee. Uh, so a nice change of pace. Another great coffee that I, I love. And this is Nitro. It's delicious, I approve. I'm meeting Wendy right now. We're gonna head up to uh, the farm. We're gonna probably see some turkeys and some goats, pick some vegetables, do farm things. I have hiking boots on, which not exactly my favorite choice of footwear, but it's necessary for this today. And I'm excited. I'm gonna fly the drone, hopefully see some cool eclipse stuff today. Let's see how it goes. There's a Tom Turkey for you. That is not as mean. He's the son of the mean one that we killed. His name is Tim. Oh my god, this is wild. Check how many chickens, turkeys, goats. There's goats over there. How many are there? Three babies, three moms, six there, two down there. They're pretty sweet looking, huh? They're, new, they're Nubian, so they're real dairy goats, unlike the other goats. The other goats are meat goats. Is it a breed difference, or? Well, they just produce copious amounts of milk. And then what do you do with the milk? We made cheese. Gave me a smoking deal on the whole bunch. <laughs> you got a good deal on the goats? Yeah. <laughs> All right, kids, we'll be back. Yep, it's a free for all. Oh my gosh. Hey, wake up. I'm up here on Mount Veter at the farm. You just saw Farmer Jack. Wendy's here. Farmer Jack's dog's Pinto. And. This place is, pr it's pretty far up here. I think we're at like almost 1,800 feet elevation. And the fo we're right in the fog line right now, so you, that's why you can kind of see this, this mist moving behind me. The eclipse is gonna happen pretty soon. We're gonna go see some more goats, friendlier goats, the most famous goats in Napa Valley. I think uh, they're Bo and Peep, I'm told. So, let's go say hello. Hey. <laughs> wow, it's not the I have no idea how you feel about this, but this is incredibly entertaining for me right now. The fog is so thick, I don't know if we're gonna actually see the eclipse, but we're still fingers crossed. Everyone's out working, tending to all the, the crops. All of this produce here goes to our restaurant. Fruit trees over here, uh, 
out apples and peaches, there's squash, tomatoes over there. It's peaceful again. It seems like the animals have quieted a bit. The goats over here, they're eating all the weeds, keeping, uh, keeping things tidy. Called tethering. They'll eat all the weeds. They can almost get to the asparagus, but we don't mind if they eat a couple of spears of asparagus. And Jack's up there picking some arugula. I think we'll, that'll be in a salad for tonight. It's pretty amazing up here. I'm, uh, I don't think we're gonna be able to see the eclipse. We're just a little bit too in the fog line right now, which is unfortunate, but we saw like the teeniest piece of it. It's just really amazing up here. This farm is really cool. I'm, I'm glad that I finally got to visit it. And uh, I think I'm gonna head down the mountain and get to work soon, but it's been amazing taking you guys up here. I hope you enjoyed this as much as I did. The goats are probably my favorite part. What was your favorite part? Uh, chickens were pretty funny. Those ducks with the, the funny hair were pretty great. And uh, but yeah, I think I'm into the goats. The goats are my favorite. <laughs>